this is uh, our annual uh, Christmas party for uh, Children with Can Cancer Christmas Foundation. Uh, and we have about 50 families here tonight. Uh, at least one of their children have been diagnosed with some type of cancer. And they're in all various stages. Some are in treatment right now, some are in remission, some uh, of the families, their, their children have actually passed and the other siblings have come to the party tonight. So um, it's kind of a tradition for our, our family and our basketball family, our players, to come and, and spend the night and, and just try to cheer up these families that are faced with a really tough challenge. In October, uh, Jacob was diagnosed with uh, lymphoblastic leukemia, and uh, so this is all pretty new to us. He's undergoing chemotherapy. He's in the third phase of five, and uh, they tell us we got about three more years left of chemotherapy before we can consider him cancer-free. But we're grateful for organizations like this that uh, really help it uh, help us to meet other parents who are going through similar type of things and. Uh, the moral support is wonderful. So. We started it because we found that there was a large number of children in the valley that uh, were under treatment for cancer. And because I happened to be a cancer survivor, and I had watched families, because I was associated through the American Cancer Society, got familiar with some of these families and the struggles the families were having, and I, I thought, you know, we need to be doing something for these families. These families are so special to, to me, and and to Dave, and um, we wish we could see him more often. We see him twice a year. We have this party, and then we have a summer luau that, that is it's a lot of fun. Um, I, I love these families, and I feel a connection with them. Um, it's amazing to watch what they go through and the love that they have for each other. And they figured out how important every second is um, in this life, and they don't, want, they don't waste any time at all, and they're making the most of every day that they have.